In this problem, we're told to find the gravitational potential energy of an 88 kilogram person standing atop Mount Everest at an altitude of 8,848 meters. Use sea level as the location for y equals zero. So in this problem, what we're trying to do is solve for gravitational potential energy or just potential energy. And we use u to denote uh, potential energy. And the formula for it is potential energy is equal to mgh. And so you could use h or y, it doesn't matter. But essentially what it is, is the height above a relative point. In this case, it's just uh, the ground. So in this case, it would be zero. But our relative, or we're at 8,848 meters. So this would be our height. So all we have to really do is just plug in. So the potential energy is equal to the mass of our person, which is 88 uh, kilograms times g, which is the acceleration due to gravity, which is 9.81 or 9.8, whatever you want to use, and then their height. So their height is going to be 8,848 meters. And so what you want to do is just go ahead and plug it in. So uh, you want to do 88 times 9.81 times 8848. So go ahead and do this. You're going to get 7638301.44. This is going to be in joules. So that's what we measure potential energy in. And then what you want to do is you can either leave it like this or just round. So this would be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So this is just equal to 7.6. Then this would be megajoules. Or sorry, not 7.6. 7.6 times or yeah, 7.6. So it's equal to 7.6 times 10 to the 6 joules, which just equals 7.6 megajoules. So you can keep it in whatever units you want. Just make sure you do what your teacher is asking. But yeah, so use any of these answers. Uh, but yeah, so this is your answer, and hopefully you found this useful.